Hi Taurus, welcome to my channel. This is a general collective reading for you Taurus. I hope you are well. I hope you're fine and safe and doing good. This reading for today is for the Taurus friends out there. What can I get for Taurus please in love and general situation, okay? Before I start, Taurus, I would like to thank you for coming back. Thank you so much for tuning in. Thanks for being here today. Guest viewers, if you haven't, click the subscribe button in the bell. Please do it now if you're interested and if you are keen. And this is your reading. That is my introduction. Let me shuffle the cards again. And we will start with your general collective, okay? If you're looking after love, I will be uplo uploading the video later on. It would have a heart sign, like a heart thingy in the um in the title so this is both love and general okay so this is for you what's up with you totals let's see what's happening to your world what can i get for you what is the message that is meant for you to know and ready for you to know this is for totals let's look at the past situation for you you've got the moon card in upright position the emperor card you've got the chariot card the current energy okay Current energy, current situation with the Ten of Cups. Wow, celebration. Uh, you've got the Lover's card. It could be um, closing a very big deal. And then Six of Cups. You could be connecting towards a soulmate or a situation you've been really working so hard for so long. And it's here. Back to back happiness. And then in the immediate future, you've got Queen of Cups. And then Five of Cups. You're missing someone. And the devil card. Okay, a lot of success. You know, I really feel like it's a success. It's um, it's it's time to celebrate. There's a win. There's a win in here. Okay. All right. Okay. Let's see. All right. Let's um let's get an overall energy for you, Taurus. What's the overall energy for Taurus, please? Okay. Good news. Okay. All right. Um. So overall energy is get the page of wands, okay? Page of wands, good news, a very good news. You took a risk. You've got the six of swords, okay? And you've got the nine of swords in upright position. You know, I really feel like, Taurus, you are going through some sort of entrepreneurship, okay? Because I don't think this is love reading, okay? I don't feel a love energy in here. What I get from the page of wands, this is a very good news, an exciting news, um, you took a leaf of faith, okay? You took a leaf of you, you took a risk. You took a leaf of a leap of faith. You took a risk towards business. Um, you went out of your comfort zone. It could be a feeling of you focus on yourself, you focus on your business, you focus on your career. And um, it has led you, you know, to be really independent. Like you don't need for some of you, you quit your eight to five job. So for some of you, you've really worked hard towards your physical wellness. You know, you've been walking a lot. You've been waking up in the morning and it has great result. You know, this is very empowering. Six of swords. You walk away. You walk away from you walk away from a person or a situation that is sucking up all your energy. You know, there are there are some. There are some people or situation that I call it vampire, a vampire, a vampire energy. You walk away from them. You walk, you walk away from that six of swords, you know, you've decided to really focus on yourself. You've decided to walk away and focus on your career, your wealth, um, something that really will give you some sort of confidence between now and in the future. OK, it's a success celebration. This is the first of the many. So for some of you, if you've been dieting, if you've been, I don't know, selling some stuff online, you have this project. It could be yourself, your body. It could be entre entrepreneurship or business thing. It could be quitting the eight to five job, but you've got a target. You've got a goal and you hit the goal or the target or you simply got a result. And this result has propelled you to do it more often. To do it more you want it more it could be the first paycheck it could be the first sale it could be the first huge improvement from losing weight okay but the, this this page of wands it's you know it is it's really is a good result from like something paid off in terms of taking a risk or coming out of your comfort zone it's really really good in the past you've got the moon card 
the emperor card the chariot card so in the past you were really contemplating on how to execute the project you're really quite confused unsure about whether you're gonna give it a try you're gonna give it a go um you're gonna connect you're gonna process the offer there's something that is hesitating you in the past you know i feel like for some of you um if love or relationship is not working in your life because this is the moon card this is you you're looking at your your moon your emotions and you're looking at the love emotions that you felt towards a person or maybe towards your family maybe you're you're giving too much of your time your effort to a person to your family and you're forgetting that oh my god look at me you know i'm giving all of my time effort and love to external people i'm not getting any return back you know so you've decided to take charge the emperor you have let go of you know you have let go of a sucker you know like a vampire sucker you know you have let go of people who who gets but do not give give something back you know you have decided to propel your dreams the chariot card in june month you've decided to really focus on a specific project or a specific goal and you have speeded up very speedy because right now ten of cups the lover's card you bag you know you were able to get you know the lover's card the ten of cups this is like you're emotionally happy with the result you know love yourself you love yourself more and you have seen improvement on your wellness journey on your physical wellness journey for some of you you finally managed to um to get the sale for some of you it could be signing of a contract but you'll get a yes from something this is a yes card you will get a yes from someone from something and it's going to give you the happiness something to celebrate and that yes that success it's connected from someone from something in the past that you've been waiting for you know i've been waiting for this for such a long time you have now you know this is a reward this is a reward of you working hard towards your goal you're quite you know hesitant or reluctant but then you know life is too short like emperor card life is too short i need to do it and here you go you came out of your comfort zone if this is not your energy then this is the advice of the intuitive to you is that go out of your comfort zone take a little bit of risk you know a calculated risk and you'll get a yes it is inviting you to take a little bit of risk to take you know to take care of yourself get out of your comfort zone and do it or something around june specifically june month that it's brewing you've been really contemplating will i do it will i not do it for some of you it's a late reaction for some of the taurus friends out there it's just about to happen for some of you it's it's already happening I think this will take effect. This will take effect a spread of 2021, the rest of 2021. It's amazing. It's a yes from something that you've been working on June month. It's a yes. It's success. It's a celebration. For some of you, if this energy has not been activated, take a risk. Get out of your comfort zone because you will really, really like it. For some of you guys, it's an amazing opportunity at work or business, a partnership. Or it's an amazing opportunity how you have managed to kind of um, reach that confident that level of confidence is amazing you know and you've got here predictive outcome and advice the devil card the five of cups you know this is a feeling where um revenge you know for some of you it could be you're winning a lottery <laughs> but this reading it's like because you're so successful you might forget to um you know to to be grounded you know because the devil card you're gonna get back to people person situation who belittle you there's an element with that there's a little bit of um bitterness in here like sweet sweet um bitter bittersweet success because you'll be like you'll be able to emerge you know look at that the emperor you will be able to emerge as a new human being <laughs> like a superwoman or a superman you know like you might not have a, you, you might not have a love interest or a relationship but you got money 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 one from another to another to another so some people might have rejected you including a love interest but that's okay because 
your money and the amount of you know success you feel it's very satisfying and this is where you know in the immediate future five of cups you might feel alone because you have everything but you don't have a love interest or you might have something that you know it's not a perfect life you know you we, we always want something and that something is the missing piece of our heart or missing something in our life so this is a bit of yes i'm successful but i'm alone or yeah i have a relationship but we don't have kids or or i have a relationship and it's really going well but you know he or she's not marrying me something like that so this this feeling sadness is is i'd say don't focus too much on this there's also a part of you that you're feeling revengeful of people or person or situation that decline you you will show them i see you i see you being tempted to show off or to express them that, 